can't seem to get rid of this hair. <laughs> I'm gonna have to re redo it. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Today is day one of a two day. I'm flying to San Francisco and I'm coming back tomorrow. I'm in San Francisco for a little over, I think about like 20 hours. I'm working with someone that I love and so I'm really excited to see her. And one of the positions of my trip just opened up. So a reserve is gonna be called for it. So that'll be interesting to see what happens there because I, don't, I still don't think they have anyone assigned for it. So today starts the second week. Don't mind this smoke, it's from my diffuser. Today starts the second week of Saqqara Life. So I started Saqqara Life last week, really enjoyed it. It was so convenient having being able to have all of my food just ready to put in my bag and just go to work. That was the biggest thing. That and then I just felt so much energy while being on it. So I'm really excited to start it again today. Um, I got my package yesterday. So usually I would do an unboxing in the morning because they usually come somewhere between like midnight and 6 a.m. in the morning, but I think what I love the most about them is how much greens are in the, like these meals. So let's see, okay. I'll show you guys what everything is. So I just need to pack Monday and Tuesday because today is Monday and I'm working tomorrow and then I will leave. I got Wednesdays too, but I'll leave that in the fridge for when I get back because I'm off Wednesday. All right, guys. I'm really excited for today's breakfast. So this is a banana protein bread, heating optional. They ha it has rhodiola in it, yum. Rhodiola is really good for you. It's good for like your nervous system. Banana protein bread with, mar how do you say that? Macerated, macerated, uh, hmm, berries. Looks so yummy. And then this, I've had this before. I had this a year ago and oh my God, it was so good. The Saqqara burrito, bur why can't I talk this morning? The Saqqara burrito bowl with turmeric corn salsa. Look at the pink rice, oh my goodness. That looks beautiful already. I already know that's gonna be so good for my lunch. And then for dinner, hopefully I have a microwave in the hotel. The Saqqara burger with chili, cashew cream. So basically you can heat up the burger and you eat it over a salad. I love all of the salad meals, they're my favorite which is mainly usually just the lunch, but I'm happy that the dinner is salad too um, with like the cashew burger. Okay, again, all of this is like gluten-free, vegan, plant-based. Let's see, okay, so this is for Tuesday. Zen zucchini muffin with coconut bliss cream. It has a little apple in there too. Yum! Sweet beet toasted cashew medley with carrot, ginger glow dressing yum so that's tomorrow's lunch and then tomorrow's dinner empress rice what is wang ki wang ki wonky wonky <laughs> interesting oops i'm gonna drop it so that's the dinner let's see if it'll all fit in my little lightweight lunch bag it all fits i'm super happy to know that two days worth of food from Sakara life fits in my little bag see i can easily just zip this up but anyway, it's time for me to request my Uber. It is nasty and raining outside. So that kind of sucks, but it's okay. That's what Ubers are for. Am I right? This is the progress we have on my little workout. I didn't start until this week. I don't remember what days I worked out in here, but this is my progress. It's not great. I want it to be a lot better so the blue lines are lower body slash cardio workouts the pink lines are arm workouts didn't do anything this day the 11th didn't do anything the 13th didn't do anything the 15th today's the 17th probably not because i'm going to be on a plane all day long today flying to san francisco it's probably going to be around a seven hour flight and then tomorrow i will i'll definitely have a blue stripe at least and then i'm off these three days so We'll see. I really want this to just be more filled out. It's not horrible, but we're making some progress. Hello. I have the strangest 
outfit on right now. <laughs> I'm getting ready to go to dinner. I'm in, I look like I'm in a ski outfit. Like I'm about to like go snowboarding or skiing. <sighs> I'm in San Francisco. Just got to the hotel. I had a lovely surprise. My friend Angelica is now on the trip with me. So I have two friends, Patricia and Angelica on this trip. I'm just gonna lightly clean up my face. Put on a little bit of highlighter so I don't look like death. Um, and I'll be ready to meet her. But yeah, we're just gonna go get dinner. I was gonna go for a walk, but it's getting kind of late. So I'm gonna do dinner. I'm not even gonna get dinner. I'm gonna eat my Saqqara life. But I am going to have a couple glasses of wine while Angelica eats dinner. So yeah, that's the plan. The flight was so easy. It was like too easy. The crowd was so pleasant. And I don't even know what else to say. The crowd was pleasant. Light load. Under six hours getting here, which I wasn't expecting. I was expecting it to be more. I better go because she's waiting for me probably. My cheeks are all red and flushed. So dinner, I ended up eating food there. I wasn't going to, but the food just looks so good. So the name of the place is Limon in um, Burlingame here in like the Bay Area. It was really good. I had two little beef empanadas and then Angelica got a ton of food and I like kind of picked at her food, really, really good. And to drink, I had a lychee sour. It was so good and funny enough, funny enough, I had like a really weird moment. There was a moment when there was someone walking by the table, this one guy, he was like looking at my table with Angelica and I, and I had the weirdest feeling that I just had this thought, like this is gonna sound super weird, but I just had this thought like, oh, we're gonna get free drinks. It wasn't like a, oh, I hope, I, I, I or like I know. It was just like this thought like, of us getting free drinks. It was really random of someone sending drinks, like a manager. I felt like it was gonna be a manager when I had that feeling or that thought. I really can't explain it. But then it passed and I, whatever. Angelica and I were talking, but maybe like 10 minutes later, our server comes by with two drinks for us. We didn't order other drinks, nothing. And he said, guys, um, uh, these gentlemen, a kind gentleman sent these drinks over for you guys. It's so random and I was like, hmm. I feel like it was that guy that walked past the table who was like checking in on us, just kind of smiling like the manager. Turns out it wasn't even him. But it's still super bizarre that I had that thought, getting another round for free. It was very bizarre. Um, turns out it was these gentlemen who were, these nice gentlemen, they were super kind, um, sitting at another table. They bought Angelica and I another round, so I had two lychee sours. They were so good. Uh, the gentlemen, they weren't creepy, weird, nothing. They just like bought the drinks, came over, said hello, the one man did, and um, then went back to the table. It definitely wasn't because of me, because I'm, I look like a nerd. I'm in like sweatpants, hokas, a vest, and a turtleneck, <laughs> and my hair is a mess. Angelica looked really cute, and Angelica has like really pretty red hair and like pretty eye makeup. So it was definitely because of Angelica. He even said, he's like, I have a soft spot for redheads. <laughs> I thought that was funny and it was really sweet. And then he left. It's kind of like my Detroit situation, but it was very nice of him to buy us a round of drinks. I waved when we left to get in our Uber. I like waved, I was like, thank you again. He just kind of like smiled. That was it. Um, but yeah, so I had two beef empanadas and then the two lychees. So I didn't eat my Saqqara life, guys. Um, I'm just gonna save it and eat it tomorrow, but I have to double check and make sure this fridge isn't freezing my food because Angelica said this hotel has a bad habit of freezing food, like the the fridges here. So I gotta make sure that does not happen. I would be so upset. I'm gonna go to bed soon. I'm gonna wash my face, put on some pajamas, and think I have my laptop with me, so maybe I'll just like edit a little bit, maybe watch something. I don't know. Then go to bed. 
Angelica and I want to wake up early and go for a walk and get coffee. I can't remember if I mentioned this or not in one of my videos, but I've been using the Burst Daily Dissolve Cleansing Balm. Oh, do I have my little headband? Hold on. This is gonna sound silly, but I mainly wanted the headband. <laughs> so I went ahead and bought the balm too. I really like it so far. I've been using it for I'd say two weeks now, a little over two weeks on my layovers because I have a different one at home, but I've been bringing this one with me, keeping it in my little carry-on toiletry bag. Wow, I look crazy. Just rub it all on. It has like a like a menthol kind of scent to it. You just rinse it off with warm water. You definitely need like like a little hand towel or washcloth for this one. Ooh, it's a little hot. Cause you gotta kinda like rub it off. Yeah, this stuff is really nice. Wow, it's really time to do my eyebrows again. When I do my eyebrows, I like to get them threaded and tinted. I didn't like threading for a while, I quit, and I would only go and get them tweezed. But I finally found a place who's really, really good about keeping them on the thicker side, and I go to this place called iStar. There's one in Beacon Hill, and then there's one in uh, South End. And so I go and I get my eyebrows tinted and threaded, and I really like it. And brush my teeth. Oh no, did I leave my toothpaste? Please don't tell me. No, I have it. I've been using these Hello Floss Picks lately. They're pretty good. I got my eyes. I got some stuff in my eyes. Teeth are brushed, flossed, faces washed, and I just put the Full Lane Brightening Serum all over my face. I love this stuff so much. Um, this has changed my skin. A good amount, I'd say. My face is just really red right now. I also filled up my little Hey Dewey. And the battery's dying because it's not giving off a strong stream, so I gotta plug it in. It's USB charged. But my Hey Dewey humidifier, this thing makes me so happy. Especially on layovers like this one where I just know it's gonna be super dry. There we go. Plugged in. So this is what I'm gonna take tonight. I'm going to take the Saluna. These are kind of like, they kind of just help your digestive system going overnight. Um, and then I'm going to take one of these Beauty Z's. These help me sleep so much. I feel like I just get a good night's rest when I take these and I don't wake up too groggy compared to other melatonin. Okay, I'm doing this face mask. I've had this face mask for so long and I just haven't gotten around to doing it. God, don't mind my nails. This is the Rael Vitamin C Face Mask. I'm excited to try it, brighten and glow. Good morning. Let's see, it's like seven something here. Let me open these blinds. These are some really good blackout blinds because I thought it was wool. Well, I thought it was like pitch black outside still, but it's not. It's 40 something degrees out. I'm layered up. I have like a little turtleneck, my little black sweater, and a vest, and my little hat. So hopefully this is warm enough. But just chugging water. Angelica and I are gonna go walk into downtown Burlingame and get probably Phil's coffee, which I'm really excited about, and um, just walk. But all right, I gotta go because she's waiting. guys I'm back and it is breakfast time oh my hip just popped um we're delayed so I I'm going to eat and we have more time now so I'm probably gonna walk again I might go back to Burlingame I don't know 
my phil's coffee was so good oh my goodness it was delicious i got the rose coffee it was so yummy it was really chilly out but now i'm warm but i want to just get in as much walking as possible but my breakfast is zen zucchini muffin with coconut bliss cream superfood spotlight anandamide anandamide it is a molecule that boosts mood promotes calm and increases pleasure its name comes from the sanskrit ananda which means joy bliss delight spread our luscious anandamide spiked coconut cream on the zucchini muffin to feel good vibes All right. this little apple is really good okay got a knife Let's try out this muffin. It looks very seedy, lots of seeds. Let's try this coconut cream. Mmm, it's good. All right, <laughs> I just ate my, I didn't just, it's been a while. I ate my breakfast, I watched a little bit of YouTube, did some stuff on my phone, and now I'm gonna go back for a walk. I wanna see how much I walked earlier today. I wanna get in close to five miles. I know that's a lot. Actually, wow, I had no idea I walked that much. I'm already at four miles. Guys, that's way more walking than I thought I've done. So five miles is gonna be cake. I might even get in six miles, at least. Okay, hmm, I really want another coffee. I think I'm gonna walk, 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 and then go get another coffee. But, oh my God, my neck. Yeah, back out into the wild I go. Um, this vest is Aritzia for those, and this, literally my entire outfit is Aritzia. If y'all haven't figured it out now, that's my favorite place to shop for clothes. But yeah, got my AirPods, AirPods in, and I'm going to listen to a podcast. I'm going to listen to The Skinny Confidential episode 425, Ryan Holiday and Robert Green, part one on how to live life during uncertain times. And then there's a part two. I'm just gonna listen to all of it. Hello guys. I'm back from a very, very long walk along the water and then back over to Burlingame. And then all around Burlingame, I went in a couple stores, got another coffee, <laughs> and now I'm back. So I'm at over nine miles, I think now. I know I'm at 20,000 steps, which is awesome. 22,000 steps, I don't think you can see it, and I'm not unplugging it because it's dying, and over nine miles. It's pretty dope. Quite pleased with that. I'm eating what was supposed to be last night's dinner. So this is the Saqqara Life Burger. It's like a burger salad. I'm just gonna, it's like a cashew burger. And I was actually really looking forward to this because I haven't tried this from Saqqara, but I've heard it's really, really, really good. Mm, super yummy. And then whatever this dressing is. Mmm, mmm. I don't know what that is, but it is good. And then what's this? That also came with it. Whatever it is, oh, it is really good. Let me see if it'll tell me what it is. It doesn't even say. Oh, chili cashew cream. So maybe it's the cashew cream that's cashew. And then, I'm making a mess. The burger might be made out of beans. That's what it tastes like. Mm, I'm, I'm hungry. After walking all that much, all that way, and all I've had is a little muffin. The muffin was good and satisfying, but I need a big salad like this with a lot of fat. It's my van time going downstairs and gonna get to the airport a little bit early before our plane lands it's just one flight back i kind of want to end off this vlog later i don't want to end it off here so i'm going to keep filming a little we'll see i'll see y'all maybe when i get home i have a bunch of packages when i get home so actually yeah maybe i'll do a little unboxing when i get home <laughs> Well, good morning, guys. It's not morning. It's noon. Why is it noon? Why am I just now waking up? Because I didn't get home until four o'clock in the morning last night. <sighs> yeah, we landed at 3 a.m. So I got home at like three something. There was an issue with the jet bridge when we got there. So it did take a while for everyone for us to get off the plane after we landed. But 
Oh my goodness. I'm just happy to be home. I'm off for a few days. I was debating picking up, but I really don't think that's going to happen. I was going to do a haul as soon as I got home. Oh, I'm, I'm boiling water because I like, okay, I'm making my lemon water and this is all regular room temperature water. I'm going to pour a little bit of hot water in there just because I like it to be a little bit warm the first thing I drink in the morning. I don't like cold stuff on an empty stomach right away. I was gonna do a haul, like I said, when I got home of everything that I got, cause I had a bunch of packages waiting for me. Well, I wasn't gonna do that at four o'clock in the morning. I looked like crap. I was tired and I just needed to get in the bed. My personality was no longer here, but I'm going to share with you guys now what I got. The first thing I got, I'm actually wearing it right now. I'm never ever taking it off. You're gonna have to pry it off my cold dead body because it's so comfortable. So remember when I said I got a gift card and I wanted to buy it, that was in my, so like two, three vlogs ago. I wanted to just get a bunch of little things to apply to everyone. Well, I, instead of just the one big thing that I wanted, well, I was able to get, I was gifted actually, the one big thing that I wanted, which is extremely sweet and I'm super happy, super grateful. Sorry, I keep messing with my hair because my hair is driving me crazy. But I ended up getting a Barefoot Dreams robe. So I've been needing a new robe for so long because my the one that I have, I love my pink robe. It's a Ugg robe. Um, it was a gift, but it's an extra small. And it just, every time I sit, it like completely, it, it doesn't cover me. And the sleeves were always like, to here and I just felt so funny in it um, I still like it and I'm still gonna hold on to it it's good for like I don't know random things this is like a lounging robe that one's really good for like directly after the shower although this one is too but you guys know I've had an obsession with barefoot dreams I know I'm like late to discover it barefoot dreams has been huge for forever but I have like all of the socks and now I have the robe and the robe kind of matches my little shoes well I don't know where my little slippers are I can't find them they're somewhere around here I think they're buried but they match them anyway so I got this robe I will have it linked down below it is on it is on a number of different websites but I got it super quick too so I'm super happy about that um also one thing i'm this someone okay the person who sent the gift card when i did the big haul asked me i don't know who it is they sent like the uber gift card too um asked me how i was able to respond to the first gift card amazon just gave me the option it said thank the sender thank the gift card sender it was like a button in the email i clicked it and i was able to write a little note as a thank you it doesn't give me that option anymore so just a little message because this person's anonymous. It's not giving me the option to respond to the gift card to say thank you, the other one. So yeah, I just wanted to say that quickly about that. I don't know why it's not letting me do it anymore. I'm gonna put my hair up. Cause since it's driving me crazy so bad, I might as well just get it out of my face. Okay. <laughs> oh, and it has this hood. Now that I put my hair up, it has this hood and it's like a big hood. I'm obsessed with it. It's just, it's like wearing a big giant barefoot dreams blanket. It's heaven. So the other things I got, I got a new Ursa Major Golden Hour Recovery Cream. This stuff has been saving my life this winter. This is the best moisturizer ever. I'm obsessed with this stuff. So I just completely ran out of mine and I ordered more. This is on my Amazon shop. This will all be on my Amazon shop. I got some band-aids. I'm trying out these Welly band-aids. These are really cute. So I thought these were all blue and orange, but now that I'm looking at like the actual case, they're like green, blue, orange, and I don't know what this other color is. So I thought it was gonna match my uniform, these band-aids, but they don't. But these Welly band-aids are like really cool. They have like all these weird little designs, but I'm into it. And and the packaging is super cute. Oh wow, they give you a lot. Okay, they're like these almost like primary colors, but it's not primary colors. You guys, I need to get my nails done so bad. Very interesting. Three of these and then a whole bunch of all the other ones. So it's just like blue or so I do get blue and orange, which I like. And then I get whatever color. This is like a 
I don't know what color this is, like a greenish. So I'm happy about these band-aids. They're still cute. They have like a bunch of different sizes. I like fun band-aids. I'm like a child. So I was with someone and they were making fun of me for getting like funny, cute band-aids. I usually, the Hello Kitty band-aids were my go-to for forever. Even as an adult, I don't care. Like, actually only as an adult. I don't even think I used Hello Kitty band-aids when I was a kid. Hello Kitty band-aids as an adult, I just love the pink. If that surprises you guys at all. Um, love the pink and it's just funny to me. I loved Hello Kitty when I was younger. There was a Hello Kitty store in our mall and I was obsessed with it. In the Savannah Mall. That was the closest mall to me. My closest big mall to me when I was growing up. The Oglethorpe Mall and the Savannah Georgia Mall. Anyway, so, oh, and then the next thing I got, ooh, there's two more things I got. So this is the DP Hue. It's like gloss for your hair. So my hair starts to get kind of like, my hair is naturally like dark brown, but I like to have it just be like have a richer look to it um, So I do go to the salon and get it glossed every now and then this is like a great for in between I actually I don't even I haven't tried it yet But the reviews are really good and I've listened to so many podcasts with the founder of DP Hugh He's a celebrity hairstylist and I just really like him as a person. He's really cool He's super grounded, smart, down to earth, and he knows his stuff when it comes to hair, hence why all these celebrities trust him. He's mainly known for being like for blondes. He's really good with blonde celebrities, but I've just heard so many good things about this that I really wanted to try it. Um, and then the last thing I got, these have been on back order for forever. I ordered these like, I don't even know when, a very, very, very long time ago, and I finally got them in the mail because they've been sold out everywhere because they're super hot right now super trendy i got the ug minis literally these took like a month and a half to get here i ordered these in the beginning of december anyway i have mini uggs now just the mini ones i like the mini ones i'm not gonna get the bigger ones mini ones are where it's at for me in my opinion and they're great so far i tried them on last night super comfortable i've never owned uggs before so I'm really happy to have these. I just picture myself sliding these on and walking over to my friend Kendra's apartment to go hang out with her. <laughs> She's a big Ugg girl, she loves Uggs. She has like multiple, multiple pairs. But I used to make fun of Uggs and say that I would never own them and look at me, here I am. And I'm so excited for these. There's just something about the mini ones. I remember seeing the mini ones like maybe three years ago and thinking to myself, oh, these are the ultra mini actually. And thinking to myself, oh, I could actually like be down with those, I actually like those. But then never got them, never really thought about it. And now they're like a thing. I keep seeing them and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna get them. So I got them, I'm happy. Look at my, my Uggs with my little robe and then my other little shoes that match my robe. All right guys, that concludes the haul. I am so pleased and happy with my things that I came home to. Definitely got rid of my little bad attitude I had for coming in super late last night, being able to come home to this stuff. So I am gonna end off the vlog here because I have editing to do for you guys. So, for those of you who are new here, my name is Vera. Y'all can follow me on Instagram, at Balanced Flyer. If you haven't done that already, go ahead and head over there. Please say hello in the comments. I love hearing from you guys. If you enjoyed this video, please hit thumbs up, give it a little like, and subscribe if you haven't already because my channel is growing slowly but surely. You know what's funny? My little side rant my views have been going up like crazy but i feel like my subscribers it's like very very slowly they creep up and then for like a week they'll like rock it up and then it'll it'll be another few weeks of like slowly slowly creeping up but my views are consistently really high so if you keep coming back and you're not subscribed make sure you're subscribed because it really really helps out my channel anyway love you guys and i will see y'all in my next video